We do some reefer, you know, from here to California. We hold chickens for prelims pride, and uh, we just uh, hold produce back to. Uh, we got a customer here in Dallas. I mean, and that's what we do. Just back and forth, we bring some all the produce for the market, and uh, we do some in dump too. We okay. discharge. Even with discharge, we hold rock, okay. sand, and gravel. I mean, a lot of guys that say I'm crazy to do that, but hey, I mean, uh, actually, that's what I started working, okay. you know, on the sand and gravel, and. Uh, I still got my wet kit, everything is hooked up, it's just, whenever the reefer is seed is slowed down, I mean, I just swap trailers and do whatever I need to do. Okay. This, tr this truck is being built by myself, well, Alex Velasco and myself, we, we did it from scratch, it's a 2003 beat. Okay. We take it apart, we stretch it, and uh, I mean, yeah. we paint everything, the floor, dashboard, everything, uh, door panels, okay. it's been done. All the inside, I thought about myself, but outside, it's been uh, by Alex, and uh, we had one of our employers, uh, Hugo, they help us to do a lot of work too. Yeah. Works for us yeah. on the shop, doing maintenance, yeah. doing some little work, you know, I mean, yeah. but yeah, I mean, everything you see, we put a lower, we make our own uh, lower, what do you call it, air right uh -huh. suspension, I mean, it's kind of, I want to say something simple, but we've done it ourselves, boxes, I mean, uh, I mean everything panels. I mean we we shoot some bed liner on that. We mm -hmm. paint it on top of the bed liner. It's interesting the drop the panel the drop panel on the frame coming down there. I don't I don't know that I've seen uh, one quite like that before. Yeah, we've been down a few trucks. I mean, uh, I mean between me and my brother we we paint maybe ten or twelve trucks we done already. Uh -huh. But you know we're not a painters. Right. I mean but hey, we start kind of get into it and uh, yeah, we enjoy it. You know. You paint the reefer too. Eh? Yeah, we paint the reefer. This reefer I bought it like four months ago in okay. Alabama, uh, no Mississippi, somewhere over there. <laughs> but anyways, I bought it and I painted under a load. In three days, I had it painted. Uh, I mean, it, we just did a quick job, you know. We yeah. sandblasted, we painted, and there is. I mean, yeah. I mean, guess I I hate to run with what kind of what it called unmatching trailer. Right, sure. I want to look good down the road. Yes, sure. sir. These these colors, uh, you get kind of an off white and. Uh, uh, what, what is the stripe kind of silver? I guess it's a silver. They call it a silver effect, and we got the cream burley from Ford. Okay. And uh, the paint on top. Uh, well, actually, the one on top they call it uh, dark mulberry. Okay. Uh, purple. Yep. The paint we got on the frame that's a factory paint on the truck. Okay. So that's a single single stage. Okay. From single stage, we went to base coat, clear coat, and this this is the paint we got. Okay. I mean, when they cross it. Uh, they come a little bit darker, and uh, for first I don't like it, but after uh, I've been seeing the truck and yeah, a lot of people, used to it. I got used to it, and, and it looks a whole lot better. And yeah. I've been getting a lot of compliments. Say, I mean, hey, where where'd you get the paint coat? And you know, yeah, I mean, but, sure. yeah, tell me about tell me about the power and the transmission. Uh, it's just it's just simple. I mean, right now it's just stock. It's a 550. Uh, matter of fact, a friend of mine he turned it up just to 600. You okay. know, but he's he just got a. Uh, you just got a Borg Warner uh, Turbo, 18 speed. Um, this is a three, cat, cat it, Oh yeah, yes sir. It's a 550 cat. Okay. Turned up to, factory was 550, but we went to 600 cat. Okay. And now uh, we got the 18 speed, like I said. Mm -hmm. We got 355 rears and uh, wheelbase. Wheelbase 307. Oh, yeah. yeah.